and always will be the greatest spectacle in racing. This is the Indianapolis 500. The dream of crossing the famed yard of bricks and bathing in the milk of Indianapolis has enticed the masses for more than a century. On the hunt for Indianapolis 500 glory is Scottsdale, Arizona's Jagger Jones, a 20-year-old partaking in the family tradition. We're standing here at, on the yard of bricks in, at Indianapolis. I mean, for my family, this is a very sacred place. Racing the Indy 500 would just be so much, just with the legacy my family has and my grandpa winning. Um, and me being able to t even just attempt that. My goal is to win an Indy 500. I mean, it's no nothing easy, and, uh, but we're, we're doing everything we can to kind of set myself up for that opportunity. The road to Indy begins with the USF 2000 series, where Jagger sits now. Drivers then advance into Indy Pro 2000, Indy Lights, and finally into the IndyCar series with a chance to race in the Indianapolis 500. Even though Jagger's childhood was primed by open wheel racing, the Jones family embarked on a stock car journey where he found victory lane in 2019 in NASCAR's regional development series. Jagger Jones' first career NASCAR victory, he wins at All-American Speedway. But when the pandemic arrived and funds didn't come together, Jagger had to set his racing aspirations aside until opportunity came knocking with Cape Motorsports in 2021. I wanted to try to make another run at racing and um, I grew up racing go-karts doing kind of more open wheel stuff, raced a little bit in Europe racing go-karts on road courses and um, I, it was something I always wanted to do as a kid and uh, I, I thought it was kind of a perfect reset for me. Jones carries one of the most legendary names in all of racing. His father PJ and Uncle Paige found success in anything and everything on wheels. And everybody knows his grandfather. Parnelli Jones, who has won the fastest Indianapolis 500 mile race ever run. The 1963 Indy 500 champion in 1973 Baja 1000 champ. That's Jagger here. Jones. Jagger Jones. That's my new favorite uh, racing name. His family propels him forward while allowing him to produce his own racing legacy. Well, they've always been supportive of my racing. and. Um, I mean, it's cool to be able to do what they were doing. They're definitely helping me, but I mean, a lot of this is pushing my path on my own and um, how do I make my name for myself with keeping the legacy behind me and I'm always remembering that. Even though Jagger was born in North Carolina, he moved to Scottsdale at a young age and calls Arizona home. His time at Notre Dame Prep and in the Valley Heat set the foundation of the path he has set forward onto. The support I got from every all my friends and family that uh, live out on the West Coast and in Arizona and from my school even, them somehow putting up with me missing a lot of high school. I was on the track team, varsity track team four years for Notre Dame and uh, kind of separating two lives there and so it really shaped who I am. Whether it's stock car or an open wheel car, Jagger Jones can battle for motorsports history as he dreams to fulfill what many have sought before him, kissing the bricks at one of the most sacred spots in sports. I mean, ever since I was a kid, I've always known the Indy 500 was the biggest race there is, um, at least in our family. That's the number one race. Memorial Day weekend, Sunday is kind of a, a, a national holiday for us, uh, just because of the Indy 500. And um, I mean, I've dreamt about it and put a lot of time and work into uh, achieving that one day. And um, I mean, it would just mean the world to me.